We start with one hour chart. Just want to give a quick update. If we refer to our analysis, in my last video, we mentioned we can expect to get the correction before we look for buy, and this is what we get. Anyway, the way is correcting, we, we expected, to, I mean, we're expecting this one to drop some more. That's why for me, if this one give me one more drop, at least it can give us better, I mean, it can give us better opportunity to look for trade because if we want to put this one in relative to this as a running flat, for buy the best things is because if the price will continue from here it doesn't mean the pro i mean if the price continue from here we cannot get a really good trade setup that's why we prefer this one at least give us one more drop and if it's if it drop to around 5.7 it can give us better opportunity to look for buy anyway it doesn't mean the price cannot continue from here it can but the only thing is how we can look for trade. If we want to look for trade, we need this one to drop some more, at least somewhere around 5.7 before we look for buy. If we want to put this two in relative to each other. And even if we get the buy, we're looking for 6.9 following by 7.4 as a target. Okay, by the way, the second target is above the previous stop, which is more than one because the previous stop is a seven. That's why if we can, uh, any trade, after the price tag 6.9 we need to see whether the price can continue and break the seven or not okay and in this case we move to higher time frame we want to see what we have based on daily chart the only thing is based on daily chart we want to see the continuation we have nothing to add then we have don't we don't have anything to discuss and if we move to forward chart the only things we need to know how i mean to care about is whether the price can break the previous stop or not because if the price cannot then we made this one turn to a flat and relative to this either for one more drop or the deep, deeper correction all right anyway if we want to look for trade based on lower time frame for buy i mean this if we want to look for buy as long as the price haven't broke the previous stop which is seven we should be quite careful and any trade we consider as a short-term trade and we should have the proper trade setup that's why if this one give us one more drop then from there, it can give us better opportunity to look for buy. Can we expect this one to look for sell? Because if we move to 15 minutes, we mentioned that we're looking for one more drop. That's mean even if we get any sell from here, we can look for short term sell. Okay, that's mean if I move to one hour chart, if we get any opportunity to look for sell from here, from this correction and relative to this move, we take it as a short term. Then after that, if we i mean we see how deep it can go then we start to manage it if there is a continuation we keep if not we take out the trade as a short term and even we can use 5.7 as a target for sell then after that if we get any reversal we can look for buy anyway we just follow the chart if i see any update i will share thanks